Hey guys, this is Jade Little Crow, and today we're going to be doing an update video and a mini haul, or big haul, I guess. Um, I am yet very sorry that I have not been able to make any videos. I will explain that right now. I've been sick. I don't know how I got this cold, but it really affected me, and I still have this cold. It's been like two weeks already, and it's going around the area, and uh, I just got it, and I haven't gotten sick in a while. So I take, you know, high school and college classes. I am in high school, and I had missed a couple of my college classes, which was not good, because if you miss so many, you do get dropped. So that was uh, really bad. But I explained it to my teachers, they were totally fine with it, they understood, and I did extra homework, and I said I'm sorry, you know, and uh, I, I just did extra assignments, and I'm still trying to finish all my homework that I have extra, so, uh, yeah. Also, uh, since I am trying to get out of school early, I have to double up on my homework, and I haven't really started much of it, because I thought it was, like, a misconception with a lot of the books. So I'm, I'm going to be starting a lot of that this weekend, so I'm going to have a lot of homework to do. So like, uh, that's basically why I haven't been able to make videos, is that major reason. I wanted to inform you guys about that. Anyways, let's get the show on the road with the haul. Uh, I had went to the Uproar Festival, if you could see this poster I've got in the background, my dad had gotten it for me, so thank you dad. Uh, 2011, so I did not go to that one. Uh, the Upper Festival Festival was my first concert, or festival, music, rock festival I've ever been to before, so uh, the 2013 one. So that was really fun. I got to see Coheed and Cambria, Alice in Chains, James Addiction, uh, Middle Class Rut. They were a really good band. I liked them a lot. Uh, and so I just wanted to show you what I got from there. Uh, the first thing I had gotten was this awesome shirt that says Uproar Festival. I know on the back it has four dates. They've gotten another top, Alice in Chains. They're one of my favorite bands and I really liked the graphics on it uh, and the back of it has the tour dates as well. And the last two things I had gotten from there is that Coheed and Cambria was having a autograph signing and uh, I needed to get my friend a present and I didn't know what to get her and she said band merch so I figured why not get her a signed autograph on a CD so uh, I got myself one in the process because I uh, I listen to Coheed and Cambria sometimes but I don't have any CDs from them uh, normally online and they aren't really one of my favorite bands I can say but they are pretty good I'm still trying to get more of a feeling for them but the lead singer was pretty cool. I talked to him for like half a minute and uh, he was pretty nice. So uh, these were the two different CDs I got. They're signed by them. And I just thought this was so cool. My first signed CDs. Yes! I also have gone to the Renaissance Fair after that. And uh, I had a blast with the Renaissance Fair. I go every year. This time I dressed as more of a fairyish folklore fairy. Uh, it was very cool to see the jousting and the archery and my throwing, eating a turkey leg and uh, wearing black zodiac dress she made. Uh, I will post a photo of that. Okay, so now that I did that, I just wanted to show you the three things I got from the Renaissance Fair. Uh, the two things I had gotten were these two foxtails. Uh, they are indeed real foxtails. People have been asking me that. Uh, and uh, I have three now because my other one's hanging up over there. And uh, I really like these to wear them on the side of my hip, to put them on my backpack or purse, to give them to a friend as a present or something. I really do appreciate these foxtails and I will love them and cherish them forever. Uh, I love foxtails, they're really cool. And the last thing I had gotten there is this trinket that holds essential oils. Uh, if you can see that. Wear it on your neck like this and put it on where you need to put it. Uh, it smells really good. I had put it on before the video. So. And the last thing I had gotten is that I'm literally obsessed with Lady Locks. 
life. Uh, she is awesome. Check her out. I'll put them down below the Instagram and uh, YouTube and the Etsy account. Uh, and I could not resist this because it was the last one she had, and I didn't know when she'd be getting another one in. I mean, there were times when she won't get something in for a long time. And so I had to get it. I've been wanting one for years, and uh, I will appreciate this forever. And it would be hard to find one like this. Uh, it's a bat in a shadow box, and it's just so cool. I Sorry, there's a glare. You could see the back of my room right there in the glare. Ha ha ha. And, uh, so, I just really think it's very cool, and I will treasure it forever. So, uh, I hope you liked the video. Oh, plus, another update thing is that I'm making a dress, uh, that is the size 36B cup dress, I think, uh, for, the, like, the chest, uh, bra size, um, and I will be finished fairly in a couple more weeks just to make sure you know it's all intact and everything and I have to make more arrangements on the dress I'm looking at it right now it's up over there in the corner yeah uh, but uh, I just wanted to inform you guys on that so if you guys want to check that out I'll be probably posting a photo on Instagram I might make a video about it too and uh, you'll guys you'll get to see what it looks like later on so I'm excited about that and I'll be selling it so uh, if you're interested in maybe buying it please contact me I will have my Instagram and you could contact me on my YouTube and we could talk about it so uh thank you and I will be seeing you guys later bye